Good morning, Las Brisas Stars. It's Mrs. Yon as your Dean of Students here with your Friday announcements and it's almost fall break. Today's an early release day and then you have Monday and Tuesday off and then we're back here on Wednesday for a short three-day week. So super excited. You guys, we had a great week with our fourth through sixth graders joining us. So we are finally all back together, which makes all of us here so happy that we're together and we're all doing a good job remember we got to keep those masks on when you're on the playground i've been hearing you sixth graders i need to have a chat with you but you've got to have those masks on unless you are running around if you are out just hanging out and talking with your friends you have to have your mask on and remember masks have to cover your nose so we can't have them down like this they have to be on so when you're on the playground, please remember that expectation. If you're running around playing kickball or soccer, then no, you can keep your mask off and put it for your mask break. But if you're just hanging out, I need you to wear your mask. So sixth graders, I'm gonna be watching you today and I want you to be wearing that mask at all times. So please remember, we're doing this for everybody's safety. All right, so I'm super excited. Today is purple and orange. I got my orange on. I'm going to have it. This is on my Thursday shirt, but to, you're going to see me on campus today in my purple shirt, which I love. So today is our celebration for School Spirit Day because it's so exciting to have everybody back. It's also our first day for our star tickets. Now, got a good amount of star tickets in the basket. I was super excited when I went out there and I saw full baskets in grade levels couple that weren't teachers i don't know if they didn't get turned in or what but let's remember to give out these star tickets these can be given out by anybody on campus so they are showing respect you are trustworthy you have accountability take ownership for what you have done responsibility and safety safety that's part of all that playground and things like that and walking on campus and doing things and including wearing your mask. So remember that stars, we gotta have those star expectations. All right, so let's get to the good stuff. It's time for the winners. Um, we're doing one winner uh, per classroom. May change that, we'll see, but we're gonna do the same as what we always do. So we have two winners from kindergarten that were turned in today. And our first winner, so kindergartners, this is new for you, how exciting. Our first winner uh, is Jaden in Miss Simcoe's room, and then we have Avery in Miss McMain's room. Super exciting. First grade, we have two as well. We have, I believe it's Oakley, Miss Lippert. It looks like Oakley. And we have Caleb in Miss Paul's room. So two first grade winners. Second grade as well, two teachers and two classes. We have Ainsley, hope I said it right, in Miss Parks. And Kaylin in Mrs. Hatfield's room. Third grade, wow, we have third grade. We have three winners in third grade. We have Vivian in Miss Guy's room. We have Mason in Miss Lawson's room, and we have Thomas in Miss Kilman's room. All right, moving on to fourth grade. We have one winner in fourth grade, Ariana in Miss Valonis's fourth grade class. Fifth grade, all fifth grade classes had theirs turned in. So, and we had from Miss Wyatt's room is Juliana. From Mrs. King's room, we have Brayden F. From Mrs. Conway is Alyssa, and from Miss Goodman is Julia. Good job, fifth grade. All right, sixth grade, we have one winner from sixth grade, and this is from Miss Vandenboom's sixth grade class, and it is Aliza. Hope I said that right. Sixth grade, nice job. So all of these star ticket winners, look at all these I drew. Woo. All of you come down 
and grab, get your prizes from the office. We're gonna have them out on the table. You're not gonna be able to go through and skim through the basket, because we gotta be safe. So, but the office ladies are gonna have them out there, so please be respectful. When you come up here, remember those stars that we have on the ground so we can keep you three feet apart. So just be patient. We'll get y'all in here. Teachers, if you wanna kinda send some a little bit slower than others, maybe kindergarten, we kinda just kinda mentally telepathically tell each other when to go but I think you guys know what I'm saying but so come on down to the office and get yours next Thursday we'll do another drawing even though it's a short week so woo, let's see how many tickets we can get in those uh three days tomorrow today Friday and Tuesday and Wednesday uh oh and Thursday so there you go let's try that again because we're not going to be here Tuesday Wednesday and Thursday all right, you guys, let's get into our All Things EQ. We've been working on the motto, I don't brag because I'm happy with myself. Today, think of all the reasons you have to be happy and proud of yourself. Can you be proud of yourself when you work hard and do your best? You do not need to compare yourselves to others to be proud. You only need to do your best. When you think about it, you have a lot to be proud of. And let me tell you, I am so proud of the week we have had and that you guys have all been doing such an amazing job and the hard work you guys put in before we even got here on Zoom. So good job to all of you. That was a lot of work, teachers too. So I am super, super proud of you. Miss Matt, our, our acting principal right now, is super excited to be here with you guys. So she'll jump on our announcements for Wednesday so she can introduce herself. But I'm sure a lot of you have seen her around. But I hope you guys have a fantastic Friday. Be kind to each other. Have a great day. A wonderful fall break. And we will see you back here on Wednesday. Have a great day, everybody.